Hey guys, welcome back to Build It Motorsport. We are still putting on the Torque Storm Supercharger. Today we're gonna mount the head unit. So I told you guys a storm was brewing. It is raining, 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 raining right now. Um, there's a storm coming in, so it's Torque Storm. Let's go. Must be a good omen, we hope, for the truck. So we've got this going. In the last video, we got the crank damper put on. Oh, it's really coming down now. We got a crank damper put on and you guys go back and watch that video. It'll be up above and click on that. That's the first video in the series. Now we're gonna go ahead and get the head unit mounted. So let's get to step one and I'll kind of cover what we're gonna do in this next little section. instructions they tell us to put okay we already got the air box and stuff removed in the last video like i said go back and watch that then uh we've got the cylinder head so this is on the passenger side cylinder head we've got an o-ring and the two bolts that are going to replace the egr block off plate with this so we've got our o-ring in there already and we've got our two bolts that are going to work and they are it's all super nice hardware you guys uh if you want to go back and watch the unboxing uh i talk about a lot of the stuff that comes with this but uh let's get this on and then we'll come back and probably go ahead and put on the next piece which is this bracket so i'm gonna get that done and do some more time lapse Here's one of the more cool parts, putting the last bracket on. So we gotta put this guy down onto there so we can hang the supercharger off of it. There's some spaces involved and we'll do that. Let's take a look at the instructions and that's how it's supposed to look. It gives you a little bit of stuff and tells you what to do there. So we're gonna get that on and do some more time lapse.
All right, got the last bracket on, firmly attached. So we are ready to put on the supercharger. So here it is. So you see how that hook was? That's where these are gonna go. You're gonna use the washers you got on this part. Don't use them on any other part. The washers are for this part. So let's get that on. Man, does that look good or what? So we've got to do the hub adapter that runs the pulley drive for this, but we're gonna do that real quick and throw the belt on and then we'll be golden to go to the next steps. So next thing I'm gonna do is throw the hub on and uh, maybe we'll start it just to hear what it sounds like, huh? All right, so that's on there, pretty simple. These are 12 point um, bolt heads, so make sure you have a 12 point socket set. Uh, and yeah, not too bad, got that on, let's throw the belt on. to rock and roll this thing is solid it is on there i'm gonna throw a filter on there all right so i got the filters thrown on there note that on the 2500s the filter hits the stud for the shock a little bit just barely pushes on it i don't think it's gonna be a big deal this tries to hit it but it just barely clears it you may have to just slightly bend that a little bit but we know as long as you don't kink it you'll be okay and so man i am so excited um the next video we're gonna run the charge piping and then after that we've got to get over here and start doing our plugs our injectors our tune our map sensor and a few other odds and ends with the reservoirs over here we're ready to go so man i am so excited you guys i'm so excited get to get this thing out of here and this little bracket here and yeah so all right guys stay tuned thank you for watching build up motorsport we'll see you on the next one Sneak peek for some of you guys. There's a supercharger on this truck. We're gonna listen and see what it sounds like. <laughs> 